Hello, welcome back. This is uh, Eugene Blanchard, and uh, in this video we're going to look at the studio instruments. Uh, the last video we looked at the studio instrument drum kit. This is what we had here. If you click on this button, here's the drum kit, and we played with that. Now we're going to find out the other studio instruments are very similar. So if I go add a track, click on instrument, if you go under the bass, we have a bass guitar. So I'll create a track with the bass guitar. And now we have a bass guitar. A similar thing is that, uh, and if we click on the electronic and pop, what we have is preset uh, bass riffs. So let's just click on this, see what it ha sounds like. And if we wanted to uh, change the bass guitar, we'd just click on default here. And now we have a series of different basses. And once we select the bass and the groove that we want, or the, uh, we can click on, this one says cradle, I'm going to just grab cradle, bring it up onto the bass, add it to the, uh, the song. Let's play and see what we got. So we'll go to our console, turn down our drums. We can also uh, change the tone of our bass by playing with these controls here. Similarly, if we uh, look at our instruments and we create another track, we can go to Piano. And we can... And we can change the sound of the piano. And the same thing is we can click on our, bring it over to here, and now we can play and see what it sounds like. Now any one of these is we can go to the piano roll, and we might as well have this start at, on the, on the beat, I'll bring up the bass guitars, same story here. If you click, uh, just one sec here, what I'm, is, I'm going to click on here, this is the second measure, and if you click on the number two here, it'll highlight all of the bass. So I can just grab it, move it, and see what this sounds like. And you can create songs like this. Uh, naturally, you can select your instrument, then you can place your notes uh, anywhere you want using the uh, piano roll view. They also have the last instrument is the strings. And the strings are kind of interesting because there are actually three strings. There's the, the bass violin, the cello, and, and the uh, violin. And we can play the keyboard here to see what it sounds like. One track, you can play three instruments. Let's see what happens when we do uh, some of the sounds that they've already got recorded. And we can change the instrument sound. do the same thing where we just click and drag the loop. Uh, let's get our time back to being here. And then you 
have quite a mess. So those are the basic studio instruments that you can play with, right? So if you need a, a drum track or a, a, a bass riff, piano riff, or strings, you can use that. Naturally, you can always go to the piano roll and uh, you can change. And change the notes, right? And that's all I wanted to talk about was the uh, studio instruments that come along. Thank you.